Like Jean Butler, I had danced me way to unemployment. But all was not lost. The following week, I started a belly dancing evening class in the community hall of a Tuesday. I hadn't a bleeding shackle, so this had to work. After me Tallowide advertising campaign, I was expecting a huge crowd any minute now. How did the belly dancing go? Oh, wait till I tell you. The belly dancing, nobody bleeding torn up to her. Ah, I don't know how, because right. I was after putting a sign in there, a sign in spa. And you know who I told? I told Natalie Crowley. And you know yourself, I telling know, Natalie yeah, Crowley, yeah. you might as well put on Sky Fucking News. <laughs> 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 we'll see you. We'll bye, see you soon. Bye, bye. Take care, Johnny. Bye. We'll tell Maisie I said hello. Yeah. Oh, he's yeah, a lovely yeah, fella, Johnny. Bye. Thanks. Oh, there you are, Maisie. Happy <laughs> I didn't see you. <laughs> what were you buying to, to <laughs> Carla? Are you married to somebody here? Uh, no, uh, uh, I am married to be uh, with a Kurdish woman. Oh, you're with a Kurdish woman? Yeah. Do you know what? Natalie Crowley's looking for a fella if you're interested. Sorry? Natalie Crowley's looking for a fella if you're interested. Now she's very big. No, I am living in Tala. Tala, uh, of course, yeah. um, this is a, a big, uh, big area. Yeah, but she's interested in any fella, like, you know what I mean? Like, she pay you. No. Hi, yes. Excuse me, is this your stall? Is that your stall? Is this your stall? Can I get that one in a size 14? See the one, the blue with the gold. Can I get that in a size 14? And see for me, fella Ali, can I get that one? Can I get the headband anyway, for sure? Tell you one thing for nothing. Advertisement is rubbish. Okay. You might ward them out. Natalie Crowley, no way. Ward them out. In any way, fuck Natalie Crowley. Everyone else has. And suddenly, it was like being St. Paul and a road to Domestos. Jesus, you didn't hear any. Mind your own fucking business, will you? Miriam, love, will you get me the car to breathe, please? Orange. I scared the bags under my eyes. But I was awake all night, so I was trying to think of a new move for my belly dancing career. So about 5am in the morning, I had an epiphany. You see, years ago, I used to be a mad joke. I used to go to all the bleeding clubs. I used to go to Sides, Temple of Sound, The System, Small Talk, you name it, I was there. At one stage, I was only five stone. The biggest part of me was me pupils. But then I met Ali and I realised that there's more to life than ringing in sick and licking the walls. Belly dancing brought me back from the brink. And I want to do the same for other people, so I started a new class called Drugs Rehabilitation Through the Medium of Belly Dancing. I think it's a great idea. Working nine to five, what a way to make a living. Harriet, 
Yous are all welcome to drugs rehabilitation class through the medium of belly dancing. I call it personally, get bangled, not mangled. Okay. So what I'm going to do is get a ball of energy and we're all going to share it, right? We're going to find our inner ecstasy. And I don't mean the yokes. Okay, so I have the ball here and I'm passing it to you. Go on. Sit. And back to me. Back to me. Down to me. Now, I used to be mad over when I was young and belly dancing brought me back from the brink. Also poetry, I used to express myself truer at the time. So I'm going to present to you a few poems of my own. Dance, dance, wherever you may be. I used to be off my head on ecstasy. I took two tabs of the LSD and to tell you the truth, I was off, Mickey. Right. Okay, we're going to start the class, right? I'll show you a few moves. Everyone into position. Then hands in the air, down. Left and right, spin. What? Why is bleeding, huh? It's not small fish, little fish, paint the ceilings. You're not a bleeding rave now. It's walk like an Egyptian, not dance like a bleeding dope. I'm bleeding out here. I'm going for a smoke. Will you watch me handbag? I'm not able for this. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous. The good news was that that shower of Robin Job Dodgers gave me a brilliant idea. An after hours belly dancing class starting at three in the morning. It was genius. Until the next day when the carpet closed me down, I said. If ye spent less time going round closing down honest Egyptians nightclubs and more time checking manholes, me poor dad still be with us. I'm after starting an embalming service for pets called Mummy's Little Pet. See, the people around tell are mad about their animals they are. They want to do right by them. Me first client was a little fella from down the road called Tommy. He asked me to embalm his tortoise. The fucking tortoise was in hibernation. The thing tried to gnaw its way out of its bandages. The little bollocks asked for his money back. I said, see you, get out of me house, or I'll embalm you, you little prick. This is me second client, and to be honest with you, I'm Delira. It's after going very well. It was a little puppy who had a distemper, and the owner gave it a smack over the head with a shovel to put it out of its misery. Now, all I have to do is lash on the embalming fluid. It's a work of art. Fuck. I'm after forgetting to take the good so I'm gonna have to steam it open with a kettle. The ideas were coming faster than a nun sitting on a washing machine. Modern art. It's piss easel. Easel. Do you get her? <laughs> Hiya. Do you know where the square is? The square. The square. Tell me where square. Yeah. Down there. Turn right. Turn right. Are you taking the piss out of my accent? Oh, no, I'm I hope not. <laughs> That's quite a, uh, an accent you have. I love accents. Do you? Yeah. Where's yours from? What's that? Where's yours from? I'm married though, but you know, I'm married. You're married? Yeah, but I'm not... I'm not uh, How the fuck would you be married? You're like not, a robber's dog. I'm not married. I'm like a what? A robber's dog. Let's be honest. If some spoofer can shit in a can and call it art, anyone could do it. <laughs> Thank you.